Hey guys, this is Austin Weed. Uh, today I'm going to talk to you guys about uh, the devil's deceit and standing firm on the unfiltered word of God. See, the devil's not going to come to us as, um, you know, someone with pointy horns and a pitchfork and with liar branded across his forehead. Instead, he's going to try and come to us as the truth. And he's going to come to us as everything we've ever hoped for, right? It's kind of like this. Um, I used to watch a TV show called Wile E. Coyote, okay? And it was a really funny show, you know, uh, this coyote comes up with all these different elaborate schemes to try and catch the roadrunner. Um, but one of the schemes that he came up with was, um, you know, he switched a dead end road sign and on a big rock wall, he painted a through road, okay? And, you know, just painted this big, nice picture of a through road. And, um, you know, see, that's what the devil does. So he tries to take what the devil, what Jesus writes, and he tries to twist it, right? And then he uh, paints a picture of a nice little life in the hopes that someone will go down that path, right? But the fact of the matter is, it's a dead end road, right? It's a dead end road. And, you know, it's very clearly marked in scripture that the devil's gonna do that, right? So if it's so clearly marked, then why is it that people fall for that, that trap? It's very simple. There's two reasons, actually. Number one is that they don't read their Bible, okay? And the second one is because the devil paints a better picture than Jesus does, okay? See, down the devil's road, you're gonna have a bunch of things. You're gonna have acceptance. You're gonna have all sorts of things like that. He paints a really nice picture on that rock, but you're not gonna be accepted going down that road. Your sin is gonna forget you the second you're gone, right? But when you go down the, the path of Jesus, it's different, right? See, Jesus doesn't paint a good picture. He says that suffering is gonna catch up to you along the way, right? Suffering is gonna catch up to you and, um, you know, there's gonna be trials and tribulations down that way. But you gotta think about the end result, right? Think about the end result. The end result is heaven. And that's far better than any, paint, any picture that the devil could ever paint, right? So I want you guys to uh, take that into consideration, right? We need to stand firm on the Word of God. We need to stand firm on the unfiltered Word of God. And we need to keep in mind that the end result with Jesus is better, right? He died on the cross for our sins. And so that means we have a clear path to heaven, even though the way may be difficult along the way, right? So uh, thank you guys for listening, and I'll see you guys next time.